And it's actually not that good. <laughs> it's, no. it's not that good. What's, What's up, up dudes? dudes? Guys, today we are going to be trying every single Starbucks fall drink. Like literally every fall single one. Fall menu item at oh, all. Oh, really? Are we going to try like the cake pops and stuff too? I think we should. That sounds good to me. I'm in for that. Basically, Starbucks just randomly came out with their fall flavors early this year. We're here for the fall flavor. I like pumpkin spice. And guys, we're not even in Hawaii right now. We're in Chicago. We're in this parking lot. There's a Dollar General behind us. Oh, you know you're back in the Midwest and you find a Hobby Lobby. <laughs> oh my gosh, we got a Hobby Lobby. <laughs> Wait, where's the Hobby Lobby? Oh, there's Hobby Lobby. Guys, this is amazing. This feels like good old Midwestern vibes, you know? <laughs> Yeah. Starbucks is infamous for their pumpkin spice latte, but what other fall flavors do they have? Oh my gosh. I really, I'm really curious. They might have a pumpkin spice loaf that we could try. I yeah, think we've had that this before. This year they actually. have some type of apple macchiato that they've never had any other year. So we're going to try that. It yeah. seems weird. Like, it, like when did fall even, it's not even fall yet. I don't think that the holidays have to be separate, have to That's be true. like in specific seasons. It's literally just the end of August and we're already getting into fall, which is kind of fun. It's weird when you you live in a tropical place like Hawaii like the the weather really doesn't change so celebrating new seasons when you're back home seeing family it's kind of the way to do it are you just gonna ask them for everything fall that they have yes but I don't think like I don't think we need to try every single variation drink like you don't every, need to try it ice like, blended and hot that's the thing so I feel like we should just choose one we should choose like ice blended or well hot. here we'll do a hot pumpkin spice latte a Ooh. pumpkin cream cold brew Ooh, yeah and then the apple macchiato whichever way they advertise it okay. and then whatever fall at food they have Dude, that sounds fire. I'm actually really hungry. Yeah, and I, we had an overnight flight last night, so I could definitely use some caffeine. Dude, me too. I'm so sleepy, you guys. Caffeine! Okay. Here we go! Let's do it. Oh, baby. That looks so good. Oh, there's two ice drinks. Ice yeah. apple crisp mock. See, I don't know how the apple is going to taste with oh, coffee. Let's go ahead and just go for it. We'll get the pumpkin scone and the pumpkin cream cheese muffin. I really like muffins. Hello, I have kind of an odd request. We literally want to try every fall menu item on the menu. Okay, that sounds fun. We don't have the muffin. We do have the scone. Today's total is $22.50 and I'll seat the window, right? Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. No problem. I guess we'll have to go to a different Starbucks to try the muffin because I really want to try that muffin, you guys. Okay, no. Appreciate it. Thank you. Now this one I already know is good. Oh, hey, no tasting it. It was gonna spill. Hey, hold up, no tasting that. Wow, I feel emotional about this. And I'm not trying to be like, I love pumpkin spice, but just like, I love the comfort of fall. And I feel like I just need this right now. Yeah. Classic first, we've got the Starbucks pumpkin, pumpkin spice, spice latte. latte. Everyone give it up. Now, I know it's a controversy. Matt, are you a pumpkin spice guy? It depends on the day, honestly. <laughs> I think if I have too much pumpkin spice, I start to hate it with a passion. I think you like it in foods, but not yes. necessarily in drinks as much. Abby makes a fire pumpkin spice chili. A year ago, you guys, we did a video where we only ate pumpkin spice flavored things for a whole day. They should Abby, let us know if they want us to do it again. Yeah, that was fun. You should let us know if we should do it again. So this right here is our pumpkin spice latte. And Abby, would you like to do the honors of being the first I to taste it? would love to. Are you supposed to lick this? I always like lick it. I guess. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. This is super fun. I didn't think that in August we would be already having pumpkin spice flavored things. I feel like we just like jumped straight from summer. That is really good. I'm pretty sure, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure the Starbucks ones use actual pumpkin. That's really good. I love nutmeg and you can really mm. taste nutmeg in that. I don't think you can beat this. You like, can't it's just, beat that. It's just a classic pumpkin spice latte. That's like a hug in a cup. And I feel like drinking this warm is the way to do it. Yeah, I don't like that cold as much. Yeah. I mean, I like it, but I really like it warm. This wow. is a classic. I'm giving it a nine and a half out of 10. I think that's a fair rating. I'm gonna give it a nine and a half too. That's getting me back into the fall spirit. I'm in love with pumpkin spice again. I don't hate it Do you quite feel like yet. you wanna sing sweater, sweater weather? Yeah. In all I am is me. I want the world. 
in my hands. Fun fact, Matt sang me that song when he was trying to woo me on like our first. And it worked. Actually, it was like our second or third date. That totally worked. I have a video of it. Touch my neck. I think we should move on to a food, don't you? Yeah, let's let's switch it up. So let's do the classic, the classic pumpkin, pumpkin loaf. Classic pumpkin loaf. That's what I was thinking. We also tried this in our pumpkin spice video for 24 hours. And I remember this one like really hitting the spot. You That's, guys. It it's, looks so good. It's moist. I know we don't like that word, but like there's no other way to describe this. Dude. Mm, I'm just gonna sit here and eat this whole thing right now. Brings back memories of fall, doesn't it? Mm hmm Like you've said, it is very moist. It tastes just as good as re I remember it from last year. I think I'm gonna give this an eight. I guess a nine. It's so good. It's like the perfect amount of sweetness, too. I totally agree. It's not too I sweet. I wouldn't pair this with the latte, though. Yeah, because you get too much pumpkin spice all in one. I mean, you could, but you can't do that more than once a season. This might go better with, like... A very plain coffee. Plain coffee, yeah, exactly. Because it's a lot of sweetness at once if you're gonna do both. Oh, but this is really, really good. It's so good. My guy just loved that. Now, how much was that though? Do you have the receipt? The pumpkin loaf is three twenty-five. Okay, that's oh, not that's too not bad. That's not bad. I would say that's probably. That's, that's a really fair. satisfying snack. That's a very satisfying snack for sure. That gets a nine out of ten for me. I'm gonna raise mine up to an eight and a half because I agree, <laughs> Abby. That is a very, very good snack. And you might need to wash it down with the pumpkin spice latte. I feel like our reviews might be a little construed because we're not trying this like everything on different days. We're kind of having it all at once and it could throw off our, our palate a little bit. I mean, I'm already sugared out. That's the problem. That, yeah. I can't do this much sugar. Next oh, is, dude. I don't know how you mix this very well, but Matt, you have to try this. This is the pumpkin cream cold brew. Wow. This was all the rage. I think it the whole really point good. is to make sure you tip it decently so you can get a taste of that and then the coffee too. Hmm. I don't know what I think about this. It's definitely not as sweet as the pumpkin spice latte. There's definitely a lot more like coffee, coffee in there, but yeah. I do like the taste of the cream on top. I really like that. I think our issue is that we just had really sweet stuff and then we drank this, but if we would have started with this one, oh, the lighting's getting oh, crazy. Oh yeah, should we, let's move for the lighting. Oh, that's hey, better. there we go. Okay, I think that this is definitely not as sweet as the other stuff we just had, so that's why it's tasting more bitter than yeah. it would if we'd started with this one. That cream on top, here, why don't you just like lick the top of this? Ooh, dude, the cream looks so sugary and delicious. Try that. Oh. Like that is really good. That's really sweet. That's the thing. I think I had a little too much coffee in that sip okay. that I tried. I'm gonna give this one a seven because it is very good, but it's not as much my style of drink. I think my style is more of a latte. For me, I think it's more the fact that it's cold yeah. and pumpkin that I'm like, mm, I like my pumpkin warm. I'm gonna give it an eight. Okay. I like it a lot. Next Ooh. is the pumpkin wow. scone. Now this looks intense. Wow, that looks so good. Now, it looks like a pastry. Wow, that's super sweet too. The icing is very sweet. It's really good. It's a lot more sugary than the pumpkin loaf, I would say. It's almost like the pumpkin loaf, but with a bunch of icing. See, it's like those gas station donuts. Dude, yes. <laughs> the pumpkin gas station donuts, 100%. Or even just the vanilla. It kind of mm -hmm. almost just tastes like the vanilla coated gas yeah. station donuts, which isn't a bad thing, but it, I wouldn't order this. This honestly might be something that I would order because I do you have a sweet it? tooth. I like the icing. I like the sweetness. This is kind of your stereotypical super sweet pumpkin spice item because there is so much sugar in there. I'm going to give it an eight. I think I'm gonna give it a seven. For a scone, it's pretty good, but I just don't like love scones, and I mm -hmm. I don't know. Because it tastes like a gas station donut, it takes That's true. less of the gourmet factor out of it. That's a really good point, because you could just go to the gas station and buy that for like $1.50. I think they could have done more spice with it. I don't know, there was a good amount of pumpkin spice. I like that. spice. I like nutmeg you and guys, cinnamon a lot. You know what Abby told me, and, and this, this blew my mind? Pumpkin spice isn't even <laughs> pumpkin. It's literally this just the spice that people use to Make flavor pumpkin the pie. pumpkin. So like pumpkin spice flavor really there's no pumpkin in that. It's like clove, cinnamon, nutmeg. And honestly, that might be it. When I taste those spices together, my brain immediately thinks about pumpkin. Thinks pumpkins. about pumpkin because they just they always get paired together. Now this drink is a drink that oh. they haven't ever had. It's a brand new drink. It is the apple crisp macchiato. Wow. Now this needs to be stirred a little. Oh yeah, should we just shake it? I hate to shake it because it looks so pretty. Give me a minute. <laughs> hey, can you please click the like button? It really helps us out and it's free and it's really quick. Thanks.
Okay, I think that's about as good as it's gonna get stirred. Nice. This drink is going to kick butt. I don't know. How do you feel about apple in your coffee drink? I feel like for me, any fruity flavor whoa, with- Whoa, 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 whoa. Any... You spilled. Any fruity flavor with coffee weirds me out. But this could blow my mind. I'm gonna go into this with an open mind. I'm gonna close my eyes so that my reaction has nothing to do with what your reaction is, okay? Then give me a sip, and then I'll let you know what Here I go. think. You can hold it, baby. I, I want to keep my eyes you closed. You can close your eyes without covering it. I'm blindfolding myself for this last round. <laughs> Matt, this is just going to spill, honey. And it's actually not that good. <laughs> it's, no. it's not that good. Uh, I mean, I faintly get apple in there. I would never order that. It tastes like you took some coffee, you took some apple cider and ice water, and mixed them together, and put a sugar cube in it. That's what this drink is. Yeah, that's not yeah. good. Yeah, dude. I'm just saying, the pumpkin spice latte. Yeah. This is the one. That is the one. This is the one. There's the, a reason. The there's room. a reason this one keeps coming back, ladies and gentlemen. That gets a five. Oh yeah, that. Ooh, four. Four. Four for the apple, whatever. It's not that it's bad. It's just not good. I think there's no other better way to end this video than trying out the pumpkin muffin. I was so excited to try that. Well, if it was it. such a hit that it keeps getting sold out, then we need to try Dude, it. Dude, I know. We're gonna find this muffin. We're gonna find it's it. the last thing we do. How are you gonna <laughs> tell me that there's another one two minutes away? Dude, this is crazy. Crazy. One minute away. We're, okay, there's that Starbucks, and it's saying that there's a Starbucks one minute away okay. from here. Living on the North Shore of Oahu, you guys, like, we have to drive so far for things, and the fact that there's a second Starbucks that's 0.4 miles away, <laughs> that's ridiculous, actually. I was gonna say, maybe we should call them to see if they have it, but, like, at this point, it's gonna be quicker if we just... Yeah. Go there. Now. By the time they answer the phone, we will be in their driveway or in their drive in their driveway. We'll be in their drive through. We're at yes. your home. Oh, Schneikies. It's a grocery store one. Who's doing it? Me or you or both of us? You. What? Both of us. My vote is both of us okay, go inside. Fine. We'll both do it together. Okay, fine. <laughs> Do you guys by chance still have the pumpkin muffin like available? We just had another Starbucks and they're out of the pumpkin muffins there. Yes! We have one left! Let's go! All and right. for the grand finale, let's try out the pumpkin muffin, baby. I have a bellyache. Oh. <laughs> Do you? I'm sorry. It's I not actually... super bad, but yeah. Ooh, she warmed it up for us. Oh. Even. Wow, that looks so good. Oh, that smells good. Here we go. Is that awesome? Mm-hmm. Mm, there's a reason that was sold out. I like it. That's really good. It that has tops like the pumpkin cream roll. cheese like halfway down it. Mm. Yep. I mm. like that. Mm -hmm. Dude, that's so good. You know what? I really, really like that. But I like the pumpkin loaf just a margin more. That is good though. That is really good. I don't know. Oh gosh, I'm getting food all over your grandma's car. I'm gonna give this a 9 out of, a 9.5 out of 10. That cream cheese frosting middle thing, whatever that is, really added a lot of flavor to the muffin. I think it tops the pumpkin loaf, even though the pumpkin the pumpkin loaf is so close, like it's so, so good. I'm giving this, this an 8.9. Really? Cause I just like the pumpkin loaf a hair, more. a hair more. And I like this one just a hair more but just than listen, the pumpkin loaf. I just love pumpkin in general. Wow. Like, can we just say tis the season? Tis the season for sure. Bring in the pumpkin. I'm not mad about it. I'm not ashamed about it. I love pumpkin. In total, what did we spend today? How much did that cost? Was that like 325 as mm -hmm. well? So I think we spent like just $25. over 25 bucks. Not too bad to try everything on the Starbucks fall menu. I feel sad that we wasted the apple one, but. The apple one sucked, you it guys. It was not I'm, it. I feel bad saying that, but. Don't try it, honestly. Unless you really think you're gonna like it. What's this one called again? Pumpkin cold brew? Pumpkin cream Co cold brew. Cream cold brew. Pumpkin cream cold brew. That one's good, but I think the pumpkin spice latte just wins. And you know what? Who's surprised? Who is surprised? There's a reason it comes back every year. There's a reason. But we love you guys. We appreciate you. I am you. sugared out, you yeah. guys, but that was so fun to make. So, so I really sugar. hope you guys like this video. And because yeah. we really liked making it. And I just hope that your fall season is very yeah. seasonal. And we would really appreciate it if you would just gently tap the like button right no, now. No, just click it. Just gently tap it. Just it takes it. about two <laughs> seconds to do it and it's completely free. Well, we love you guys. In three, two, one. Peace, Peace out, dudes. dudes.